And now if the ranking member uh, of the subcommittee, Senator Thune, would like to make a statement. Thank you, Madam Chair. Um, I think uh, we've all been down this road before. Uh, and I think that Senator Cruz, in his opening remarks, uh, hit on a number of issues that I think uh, I find disqualifying for uh, the nominee. And I would, we have big differences, I think, as, as perhaps a lot of people here know, when it comes to major policies. Ms. Sohn is interested in reinstituting the Obama-era heavy-handed net neutrality rules that were reversed under then-FCC Chairman Pai in 2017. Uh, rules that uh, I would remind people would regulate the internet like a public utility under Title II of a 1934 law. So that in and of itself, it, to me, represents a major, major uh, problem from a, just a policy standpoint. But I, I also want to reiterate some of the things that were mentioned by Senator Cruz in his opening remarks. And, and that is, I think, Ms. Sohn is an FCC official. Um, you know, we're going to talk about this a little bit later. But the issue of leaking non-public confidential information uh, further speaks to the fact that if confirmed, uh, you're not going to bring the spirit of bipartisanship that present and past uh, commissioners demonstrated. Uh, your long record. I would say a virulent partisanship has raised a number of questions as to whether or not you can serve as an impartial commissioner, and I think those concerns remain. You've been outspoken critic, uh, as Senator Cruz pointed out, of conservative media outlets that you would be in charge of regulating. You've supported far-left initiatives such as defunding the police, and you've been hostile, I would add, to broadband companies serving rural areas like those in my home state of South Dakota. So I would just uh, close by saying that almost all, if not all, uh, individuals in politics have strong convictions. But serious leaders demonstrate the ability to act in a fair and impartial manner. Uh, you have not. And Madam Chair, should this nomination come for a vote before this committee, I'd urge all, urge all my colleagues uh, for those reasons and many others, which I'm sure we'll get into, to join me in opposing the nominee before us. Thank you.